you know that the day the police came to our house um, so um, my, my son came downstairs I was I was vacuuming downstairs and my son came downstairs and he said mommy the police are are at our house and I, I assumed he meant they were like outside here yeah. for the neighbors yeah. and he was like no 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 they're in our house and it's like well what how, how? so I, I went upstairs and there's um, there's several officers and one of them had a big riot shield but they wouldn't tell us what happened they just told us well they asked if Morgan was home and I, I said no um, that she was at the park with her friends and there was some confusion because um, my, my son wasn't aware yeah. that she had gone to the park. Oh, so he God. said Morgan was home. Oh, so I mean, they were instantly, they thought I was lying. They thought they I was, hiding her yeah, hiding her. Um, um, and they asked to search the house and they searched the house and of course she wasn't there. Um, but they wouldn't tell me what had happened. They just told me that, um, that her friend was hurt and she said that Morgan did it. And I mean, instantly I just, yeah. I couldn't even fathom how, how that could have happened. I mean, Morgan was such uh, she was just always such a, a gentle yeah. and, and kind person. She was, uh, she was a vegetarian because yeah. she didn't want to hurt animals. Um, but yeah, they just, they wouldn't tell us what was going on the entire day. They, they didn't tell us that what was going on and they sort of, horrible. we were sort of made to um, be under the impression that, um, that Morgan was missing and she was in danger too. Yeah, and they didn't know where Morgan was. So you just sat in your house with these But sat in with an officer, yeah. Um, until they said they had found Morgan um, and she was at the police station and that they just needed to, um, they needed to ask her some questions to sort of clear up what had happened today. You know, and they, they would let us know when they were done. Um, and I, I called and I called and they just wouldn't tell us anything. I mean, we, we still, we had no idea that the severity of what sure, had happened. Sure. So we decided to um, to just drive to the police station, and I mean, we, we thought we were going to pick her up. That's how like clueless we were about everything that had happened. We thought that we were just going to go and pick her up and go home, and and that would be that. When we did you find out what sat you there. We sat there forever, and they still wouldn't tell us, and they wouldn't let us have access to her. And finally, um, they came out, Detective Casey, and uh, that other detective, the one that interrogated Anissa, and they they told us that. Um, they told us that Morgan tried to kill Bella and that she did it for Slender Man. And, uh, it, yeah, just, what? And that they'd been planning it, they said, and I mean, and basically that she was being charged with attempted homicide. I, it was, I'm just in shock. I mean, you're just in shock. I mean, I, I sobbed, I, I threw up. I ran to the bathroom and I threw up. Um, and it just didn't even seem possible but even like at that point they didn't tell us exactly what had happened I mean we still didn't know what she had been accused of yeah